Hey guys, this is a video on how to set up the CDEV vehicle shop. The first thing you want to do is do your slash command CV shop. And then to start a new shop, you just want to go to new shop. Give it a name, a logo. Uh, you could change the blip ID to whatever you want and also the blip color. Once you do that, you want to set the blip location. Okay, now to set up the tablets, this is how customers will uh, view your stock. You just want to you want to go to set up tablet, and then go over to one of these. Mark this as the tablet. Once you've done that, you want to, you want to set up the showroom, which is uh, how people will browse your vehicles or see what vehicles are in stock. I'm just going to go through and set up a couple here. Okay, now you've done that, you want to set up your spawns. This is where your purchase vehicles will spawn and also the test drive. Okay, now that's done, you can set up your management. I'm just gonna make this desk the management so any employees in the management can access this. Okay, now you've done that, you create the shop, you just go and hit create. Okay, once you've done that, you wanna set a owner, so just go to manage shops again. Select your shop. Go down to employees. Add employee, put the character's ID in, and also add employee as owner. There we go. So now what you want to do is reopen the shop. Go to manage shops, select your one, go down to update, and press update. Anytime you do edits, you need to update the shop afterwards. As you can see, as the owner of the shop, I can now access this. So a few things, um, if you want to buy stock, you need to add money to your account. So you go in here, company vault, just add uh, deposit money. There we go. I know you can start ordering your vehicles. To do this, you want to go to manage stock. Go to the order tab and all these vehicles you can order. For the purpose of this video and this building, I'm also going to be doing motorcycles. Okay, so you can change the resale margin for these. Um, so say I have a Faggio Sport, which is 7,500. When you go to shop settings, you see resale margin as 100%. So I will sell this vehicle in this shop for 15,000, but obviously you can edit this to resell them for as much profit as you'd like. And also there's set uh, sale employee bonus. So employees get this percentage of the vehicle that they sell. Once you're done. Now that you've done that, you can come over here. Obviously, we set this up prior, so this is the tablet. Browse stock, and it shows all the vehicles in stock. Um, as an employee, you can also change the, dis uh, the display vehicles of your vehicles that you have in stock. So I can obviously go to any of these three. Carbon RS is what you see right now. I can change it to that one. Change it to a sport. Change this one to a double T as well, and so on, so forth. 
So a few other things. You have uh, manage all. So you also have manage uh, orders, which uh, employees will also see as well as management. So if I go ahead and buy one of these vehicles, as you can see, uh, margin is at 100%. So it's double, well, 100% of the price you buy it for in the orders. So it's at 15,000 right now. Go ahead and buy that. Now, like I said, as an employee, you can come over here, go to manage orders. And now you can see that the active order is just me right now. You can see it's a Faggio Sport, 15,000, accept. And as you can see, I got 5%, which is 750 or 15,000. And the car will spawn here. Or whichever vehicle you have there. There are many, there are a couple of config options that you can set. So one is the vehicle doesn't spawn, uh, poof when the test drive runs out. Um, you can also do uh, how many numbers on the plate there are. I think default is six, but you can change it up to eight with the uh, cubicle framework. But yeah, that is the uh, C Dev vehicle shop in a nutshell. This has been a holiday. Thank you for watching.